Hey guys, it's the B Rave here, and I got my special guest, Owen Wilson, the crazy hair man. Yeah, hello. One, one, two, three. So subscribe to his channel and watch his videos, which he'll be making soon. And uh, today we'll be doing play, which is where me and Owen on nearly every Sunday make videos about game reviews and game previews and stuff like that, really. Yeah. Um, so here's a couple of games that you'll be expecting in 2012, which will be really good. So we've got uh, Mass Effect 3, yeah. uh, Halo 4, uh, Far Cry 3, Bioshock Infinity, GTA 5, uh, Resident Evil, Last of Us, uh, Max Payne 3, and Hitman Absolution. Okay. Um, the trailer just came out for Far Cry, well the, the main trailer for Far Cry 3, it came out the other day, um, <coughs> not the other day, the couple other, weeks yeah, a couple of weeks ago. And it was about a um, a guy and a group of people. One was called Jason. Yeah, I can't remember what the other guy was called, but they, it was just basically showing you what the story's falling around, what he's doing there, what his kind of yeah. objective, main kind of objective is to, to be on that island. Yeah, so we see Jason and his friends, they, it looks like they've just found an island and they thought, oh, it'd be good just to have a little party and have a look around. They feel like they're explorers, they've sort of done the same before. Yeah, 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 they just look a bit like, oh, oh yeah, it's good to explore and stuff. And then they, you see them, they're in a bar, they're like uh, having some shots and stuff, and then until, boom, this guy called Vaz or something, the, the crazy guy who just... Keeps swearing. He, yeah, he swears a lot, and he's really, really crazy, honestly. You see a trailer, watch it, it's yeah. amazing. Uh, Last of Us. Owen is the non-one expert about Last of Us, so if you'd like to take it away. Yeah, so Last of Us looks good. Uh, there's not even one trailer release, but there's been lots of, yeah. you know, I mean, I read a, a magazine, and they said they're basing it on, like, uh, zombie series, uh, The Walking Dead. So, I mean, it'll be something like you expect to feel something like that in the game. Yeah. Uh, there's been lots of books inspired by it. I mean, there, I mean, if you want to read a magazine, there's lots of them, and they will show you some stuff about it. But yeah, <coughs> expect to see something like that. Uh, the guy in it, the old man, I forgot his name. Uh, Joel. Joel, that's it. Joel. And Ellie. They aren't related at all. It says in the magazine that they just have no relation at all. Like, they're not boyfriend or girlfriend, or they're not related in any kind of way. But... Uh, maybe he just picked her up as a child or something like that. Yeah, like my theory is it's like Joel. He was in like he's forty now, so yeah. the infection's been going on for a long time. So in his early days, he's found Ellie, looked after her, um, taught her and stuff. They said um, <clears throat> it was going to be what inspired them to make the game. One of them was um, No Country for Old Men, yeah. and I saw this uh, concept art of Ellie and Joel just near a campfire and they were just laughing. I don't know why but it just reminded me so much of old, uh, No Country for Men. Cheers mom. Cheers mom. Characters, it, the game is going to be a lot more character based because they, they just kind of, at the moment, they don't really like the zombie populace yeah. games that are coming out because yeah. they all think it's a bit too crazy, unrealistic, like heads exploding, you know, badass guy, and tough guys, you know, just killing yeah. zombies. And so they're going to be like a lot more character driven in the game. Um, you don't play as Ellie at all, you're the old, uh, you're Joel, and he isn't like one of the huge tough guys badass guys. He's no, just, he's just a normal guy. Yeah, he just learned how to use a gun and now he's just trying to survive with Ellie, you know? Like, the trailer reminded me so much of um, I Am Legend. Yeah. Like, I am, in I Am Legend, Will Smith was Robert Neville, who was a major in the army. He knows how to use guns. He's an expert and stuff. But Joel is just a normal guy. Um, don't know what his past jobs were. Yeah. I mean, I guess maybe he's retired. No, like no really, um, like, badass weapons, you just see him, he's got a revolver, yeah. and you see Ellie, she's kind of got like um, a little scar above her eyebrow, so you see she's been in the wars and stuff, she's not really a girl that would go, oh god, it's a zombie, run away, she's more of like a fight and stuff. And you can tell that he doesn't really want to kill the zombies as much, because in the mm. trailer he goes to shoot him, he looks very reluctant to, to, you know, go ahead and shoot someone, or, yeah, you know, he just doesn't want, want to do that, but he will to, 
protecting myself and Ellie. So. If you look in the trailer, there's um, they're in the bathroom. I know it sounds kind of gay, but uh, Joel and Ellie are hiding from these infected. Mm. Um, and you see Joel, and he's kind of like perched up against the wall as Ellie and, and Ellie, and Ellie's uh, standing next to him, and she uh, she kind of like looks down at his weapon. You don't really see it, and kind of gives him like a little nod yeah, to, to say to say like um, oh you know you have to do this. you have to do this. Yeah. So he kind of like takes it out and clicks the weapon, and then and soon that, that clicks, and they hear that, and then the uh, so I should say um, that them hearing that might give us like, a clue that these zombies are going to be maybe a lot more smart than most of them yes. because I mean the fact that you just heard that clip yeah. know, it's, quite, it's quite good you know yeah um, what else yeah you see Ellie she's she um, says like there's never she doesn't know what like she's been brought up in the infection she was born as a baby into the infection so probably near the earliest days of the infection maybe, but maybe her mother died as you know, could yeah. be birthed her. Maybe that was it, because that could happen. Uh, or or uh, maybe she was like, like born before the infection, but like only like a week or a month before the infection, and Joel kind of looked after her. He might have been like an old relative or, you know, like an old friend, but he look he looks after her. Um, and she she doesn't know what the old life was. She doesn't know how like how we live now. We don't know how to use banks and stuff. She doesn't know any of that. She just knows. She's been brought up in the infection, and she has to kill to survive. Um, and if sorry, if you don't know how the whole infection got in there, it's basically. And if you want to find out how it works, there's a video from the BBC documentary of an ant being breathing in these spores that are released from a fungi, and it will only do it with one type of like insect, which yeah. kind of tells you that they only they may they may have like changed to humans, and they only do it on humans. And uh, yeah, so. And it like affects them, so it makes them kind of like like gets in their brain. It makes them do things, and it will, they'll just die in a certain spot that the, the um, spores in their head will tell them to go, so they can grow like a like a leaf or like a yeah. like log or somewhere dark and damp where they like it. And then it will just release out of its head, and then uh, it will release more spores. And there's many different types of this fungi, so that might be like different yeah. infected looking infected because they're different types, and it will deal with different insects and they look all different so also in the uh, bathroom scene you see um joel as soon as he clicks the weapon he kind of like turns of, um, around the corner and then the infected jumps on him mm. and he that was kind of like a distraction for ellie to grab her knife and stab the um the infected in the back uh so that obviously shows that they've done this a load of times you know as in joel does the instruction and then ellie will come around and just Melee it. She and doesn't just hide it. away, like or scream or. Yeah, she's just, not. You're not. She's not scared of them as much as. She, yeah. Most people would be. You know, she's not really scared. She kind of like at the beginning. You see her run for the corridor. He. She hears the noise and she. She flicks a knife out so casually. So she's done this before. Definitely looks like they killed someone in there because that structure start of the trailer. You see a fresh pool of blood. So someone's yeah. definitely gone down there. And maybe they're just finishing off like the last guy that was in there. Yeah. But they're, they're definitely holding off in there. Maybe that's. Just Okay, that wraps up for today. Um, hope you enjoyed watching this video with uh, the B-Rave 360 and the crazy hair man, 123, who's just left, but uh, I'm still here. So make sure you check his channel out. And uh, yeah, he hasn't made any videos yet, but you will see. Um, yeah, so make sure you enjoy that. Stay classy.